Hi, this is Kelly from Play Learn Talk, and this is the tutorial for Help Cal Get Dressed, the Winter Clothing Edition. We're going to go ahead and hit start in the bottom right hand corner to go inside the game. Here is our instruction page. Help Cal get dressed by putting all the clothes in each dressing room. The game comes with a total of five dressing rooms. Each dressing room is going to have nine clothing items. Now I've designed this game with therapists in mind who are leading their virtual sessions. It could be for speech therapy, it could be for occupational therapy, and it's primarily intended to be used with preschool, kinder, maybe first and second, but really any kids who are working on identifying and labeling and describing clothing vocabulary specific to winter. Let's go ahead and learn the vocabulary. Now this section here, you can choose to use it or you can choose to skip over it. If you're using this game again and again or you have students who are requesting to use it, maybe you only want to use it the first time to label the vocabulary and then you want to skip on to the game portion in the next session. It's really up to you. It's very flexible for your use. Now in the fill in the blank boxes, you are going to read the word, which is to the left of it, and then type it in. Now if you're using this virtually to lead your session, your students are going to be spelling the word aloud to you, and you're going to be typing it in. Now if you want to, you can use the submit button. That is simply going to measure the accuracy of the spelling once everything has been filled in. Now either way, I'm ready to play is the button you're going to hit as your next navigation button. Here is the framework of each of the five dressing room pages. It says, name each item as you put it in the dressing room. When it's all gone, move the door over to see Cow's outfit. Okay, so each of these clothing items is actually a draggable piece that has verbal output attached to it. So when you put one in like this, sweater, it actually says the word sweater, okay? And then it reveals the written label as well. Now, you could use this to have your students tell you what to put in um, or what outfit they hope the cow is going to wear, or you could just go in order. You could have them describe it. It's really up to you how you want to use it in order for your student to get to put a clothing item in, okay? So you can make it really simple or more difficult as the game goes on. So let's go Boots, ahead and put all the items mask, in. Mask, scarf, snowsuit, mittens, pants, hat, jacket. So once all items are in, at this point, I'm going to ask my students, what do you think Cow has decided to wear? It's really fun when you have it in a small group and they're all kind of voting on what they think the cow is going to choose. All right, it makes it really fun when the cow actually is wearing your outfit or some of the items that you selected. So you're simply going to move this door over and then you can actually take Cow out and move him or her around the page and talk about what the cow has decided to wear. Now, down here we have our navigation buttons. The back and forward arrow, of course, take you back and forward. And the Play, Learn, Talk logo is going to take you back to your original navigation page. All right, so let's go ahead and skip ahead. And we get to the very last page here, which is going to reveal all five outfits. And this presents your students with the opportunity to talk about their favorite outfit and explain why. If you wanted to play again, you could hit Play, Learn, Talk. It'll take you back to the beginning. And if you just want to finish the game, you can do See You Later, and it's going to end your session of the game. I hope you enjoy this game. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me at Play, Learn, Talk, and find me on Boom Learning at the Play, Learn, Talk store.